company started, there were two brothers up at Burton, Kansas, uh, Larry and Bill Matlack, and they were doing a lot of large bales and trying to decide on a way to pick the bales up faster out of the field, and they came up with the, with the Stinger. Originally, they started with just the, what we call the red iron. This is a used Stinger in 08, and that was the year before we came out with the computer system. You had to add cylinder stops on this one to pick up what size of bale you're picking up. With the computer now, it's all automated. You just hit a button and it adjusts to what size bale you're picking up. Has a load counter on there. Has an option in there to where you can pretty much troubleshoot the whole machine if you have a problem with the computer. We do offer a wrap or two that is up at the Chick Shea station that you can wrap bales with. And uh, we are coming out with a new Stinger 2 that will do one stack where you have to do two stacks with this machine. Stinger 2 will do stack all 12 bales at one time or retrieve them all at one time. We're using our Stinger that picks up the big squares, big round bales. It'll pick up all sizes of bales, three by threes, three by fours, four by fours, and the round bales. You can move approximately 100 bales an hour to the edge of the field with a Stinger. As any more manpower is getting to be a big deal and where one man can go out with a Stinger and do the job of what a lot of guys will have load with the tractors and the trailers. Well, they'll take two or three tractor drivers. They'll have a tractor driver on each end and then they'll have a truck running back and forth. So you've got at least three, if not four, operators out there to where one man can do it in a Stinger. <laughs>